bought this building back in 1990. Uh, 1990. December 1990. It was built in 85, I believe, and we bought it in 90. And so we've owned it since then. What's it been used for? This Offices. It was a multi-tenant building mm -hmm. originally, and we bought it at that time when it was still had a number of different tenants in the building. As those leases expired after we bought the building, those tenants uh, relocated. And then we continued to move uh, staff into the building uh, as our space needs dictated. It has had many, many occupants over the years. It had restaurants and many retrofits over the last many years. We had the building probably about 80% occupied at the time we decided to do the renovation. And so we moved everybody out, moved them over, moved over to the 1215 Boulder building and, and uh, did the renovations of everybody back. Once we actually got turned loose to go to work, we had six months and uh, a multitude of changes as the users became familiar with their new spaces. Uh, the different department heads had multiple requests for things other than what were in the original plans. It's not so unusual, is it, with a project like this? No, particularly with a retrofit. Once you get the building empty, you find a lot of things that were unknown. You stripped a lot of that out? We stripped the entire building. The air handlers were the only infrastructure that remained. When we took over the building uh -huh. in 1990, we pretty much left it like it was as a multi-tenant building. Mm -hmm. And so it was not real functional because we were still dealing with all this chopped up space, you know, within the building where you had walls and offices that you really didn't need a wall in an office. Or, and so, we, so it gave us the opportunity to basically uh, uh, do a demolition of the interior space and then rebuild it the way that it was more functional for us. And so our capacity will actually be higher when we're all done than if we'd have just continued utilizing it the way it was. Actually, this one is a little bit more upscale than most office buildings. The level of finishes are, are quite a bit higher than are, are more commonly seen. Actual renovation cost was about eight and a half million, and then we had furniture and fixtures on top of that. You know, so the total cost? Oh, it was in the thirteen million neighborhood.